Homeward Bound Daily Devotional by Alan G. White Rescue Souls Before Jesus Ends His Ministry October 23rd Go into the highway and hedges, and compel them to come in, that my house may be filled. Luke chapter 14 verse 23 It is of no small thing to be a Christian and be owned and approved of God. The Lord has shown me some who profess the present truth, whose lives do not correspond with their profession. They have the standard of party altogether too low, and they come far short of Bible holiness. Some engage in vain and unbecoming conversation, and others give way to the risings of self. We must not expect to please ourselves, live and act like the world, have its pleasures and enjoy the company of those who are of the world and reign with Christ in glory. We must be partakers of Christ's suffering here if we would share in his glory hereafter. If we seek our own interests, how we can best please ourselves instead of seeking to please God and advance his precious suffering cause, we shall dishonor God and the holy cause which we profess to love. We have but a little space of time left in which to work for God. Nothing should be too dear to sacrifice for the salvation of the scattered and torn flock of Jesus. Those who make a covenant with God by sacrifice now will soon be gathered home to share a rich reward and possess a new kingdom forever and ever. Oh, let us live holy for the Lord and show by well-ordered life the, the God and godly conversation that we have been with Jesus and are his meek and lowly followers. We must work while the day lasts, for when the dark night of trouble and anguish comes, it will be too late to work for God. Jesus is in his holy temple and will now accept our sacrifices, our prayers, and our confessions of faults and sin, and will pardon all the transgressions of Israel that they may be blotted out before he leaves the sanctuary. When Jesus leaves the sanctuary, then they who are holy and righteous will be holy and righteous still, for their sins will then be blotted out and they will be sealed with the seal of the living God. But those that are unjust and filthy will be unjust and filthy still, for then there will be no priest in the sanctuary to offer the sacrifices, their confessions and their prayers before the Father's throne. Therefore, what is done to rescue souls from the coming storm, wrath, must be done before Jesus leaves the most holy place of the heavenly sanctuary. Thank you for listening. This is your daily devotional. We hope you can join us again tomorrow. Homeward Bound